Caramel fudge, skinny raw bars are the subject of today's food for thought. My name is Jodie Bunting. This is our daily live health tip to help you lose some weight. Today, we've got the third and final flavor in the skinny raw bars range. So for those of you who haven't discovered them yet, uh, basically skinny bars are really popular, really famous. There's only one problem with skinny bars, regular ones, is that they contain artificial sweetener, which can slow down your weight loss. So, like magic, ta-da! Skinny have introduced something called Skinny Raw. Instead of being sweetened by artificial sweeteners, these are sweetened by pressed fruit. So they are literally just pressed fruit and nuts. Uh, that's it. Uh, they do have a little bit of caramel and fudge in as well, just to give it some lovely flavour. Uh, the less than 99 calories. And as I said, they do chocolate brownie, they do raspberry and white chocolate, and then this is the last one, which is the caramel and fudge. I've tried the other two, I've never tried these, so we are going to try them live on the video. Uh, you get three in a box. At most retail outlets, they retail at one pound each. However, if you pop yourself to home bargains, you get three in a box. For 79p. That is my big reveal today, guys. Uh, they've just been, the price has been slashed. I think it's because they're so popular. And literally, there is loads of them in home bargains, guys. So, and this is my big money, money Lewis, Martin Lewis, uh, money top, top money saving tip uh, is the fact that. Home bargains does seem to be a lot cheaper than b and I've noticed. I went around both the stores the other day, uh, and I did notice on a lot of products, home bargains do seem to be cheaper. So that's my big money tip. Right, so let's get trying this, guys. So this is the skinny bar. Uh, there is 96 calories in one of these. Uh, the ingredients, I will just lift my glasses up to read the ingredients. Dates, 66%. Coconut flour. Uh, Oligro fructose. Anything that's O's at the end, it means it's sugar. So it's fruit sugar. Caramel fudge pieces, which is 6%. In there is sugar, skimmed, sweetened, condensed milk, glucose syrup, butter, fondant, uh, which is sugar, glucose and syrup, emulsifier, natural flavorings, salt, ground almonds, which is 4%, uh, fat, reduced cocoa powder, sunflower oil, rice flour, and natural flavorings. So when I read out the instruction leaflet, uh, the instruction, the the ingredients list, it doesn't sound as healthy as you, you would make out. And for those of you who eat a naked bars, uh, a lot of the naked bars literally have four or five ingredients. So there is some uh, room for improvement, but definitely these are better than the regular skinny bars. And as I said, uh, I've said previously, naked bars and stuff like that are two quid, where these you're getting three for less than a pound. And also they are less than 99 calories because they're nice and small. So without further ado, let's bang it open, guys, and let's get testing it. So a lot of people have said, oh, actually, that smells really nice. A lot of people have said these uh, raw bars, they don't smell that nice. Because obviously, you open it expecting that lovely smell of sweet chocolate. But you kind of get this fruit kind of date smell, which sometimes can be a bit earthy. Because this has got the caramel pieces in, this actually does smell lovely and sweet. So... As I said, my mouth is literally like salivating like crazy right now. So let's give this a try. Oh, nearly dropped it. You can see the almonds. Is it an almond? Or is it a fudge piece? Let me have a second opinion. I actually really like that. Normally with these things, 
the chocolate one is the best just because it's got a strong flavour. But the caramel, the caramel fudge is really strong. And I actually really like that. I'm well impressed with that, guys. So as I said, these are the Skinny Roll Bars available at Asda, Morrison's, Poundland, Home Bargains and other famous discounted retailers. Right, that's it for me for this Friday night. Good evening, Aaron. Uh, that's it from me, guys. I'll be back in the morning uh, with a live workout at 8am where tomorrow we're doing stretching. Good night.